I need something to get clicks because it's a goddamn ghost on over here. Be advised, my OnlyFans is now 20% off. Weirdos are gonna come after y'all. Freaky ass nigga, he a 69 god. Freaky ass nigga, he a 69 god. Oh no. Never. <laughs> oh no. What's going on, good people? I hope all is well. Today, we are gonna violate Yahoo. So I'm giving you an advance warning. We are gonna go graphical because since they wanna violate the Sanders and keep disrespecting them, we gotta return the favor. As you can see on the screen here, we're gonna start over here where it says how Yahoo missed out on hundreds of billions of dollars again and again. And shout out to Bennett. Shout out, baby. Shout you out. So let's get started, man. Yahoo was worth $125 billion, right? And now, look at them now, baby. Look at them now. They are worth not even a penny and a goddamn dollar. $4.8 billion in today, right? So now let's talk about why Yahoo is a goddamn failure and how I'm going to tie all of this in one of why this article right here that says if his first read wasn't clearly open, Sanders would constantly go into chaos mode and not with overwhelming great results. So before we address that over here on this screen right here, we got to start over here. We got to get off in Yahoo's ass. And I promise you, everything will make perfect sense. Let's go. So in 1998, right, Yahoo refused to buy Google. They refused to buy Google because Google wanted $5 billion, but Yahoo was like, nah, I'm only going to pay you $3 billion. I'm not going over $3 billion. And then Google was like, all right, Yahoo, go fuck yourself, right? So Google never sold itself to Yahoo. So that's deal number one that they fucked up on. Because in life, you're like, man, you don't get many opportunities, right? You don't. But Yahoo, once again, God was like, all right, Yahoo, I'm going to give you one more shot at the title, man. I'm going to give you one more shot. So Facebook was like, all right, Facebook, I'm going to sell you Facebook Yahoo for $1.1 billion. Once again, Yahoo was like, nah. I'm only going to give you $800 million and that's it, bro. We're not giving you any penny more. Facebook was like, man, go fuck yourself, Yahoo. And then you're like, God damn it, Yahoo. You just had some great opportunities there. What happened? All right, man. So you got to Microsoft because Microsoft wanted to compete with Google. And I'm saying, so they were like, all right. All right, all right, Yahoo. We're gonna buy you for forty-four point six billion dollars. Yahoo's like, nah, baby, we want fifty-three point six billion. And uh, Bill Gates is like, Yahoo, go fuck yourself. Go and fuck yourself, Yahoo. So let's tie it all together. When you look at articles like this over here and wondering why is Yahoo keep doing these hit shots against a man Colorado? Why do they keep doing all of this, man? Why? Because Yahoo didn't and still don't know what to do with the goddamn internet. They don't, and that's why they keep losing money. And uh, on a side note, if you still have a Yahoo account, you should be arrested. You should be arrested and thrown in the goddamn hole or the goddamn block, whatever the hell it is. That's where your people belong with a goddamn Yahoo account. So now let's tackle my man, Nate. Nate Tice. Let's see Nate Tice who is. Who the hell is Nate Tice? Let's get over here. Let's get over here and see who Nate Tice is. Where are you, Nate Tice? Let's Google you real quick, baby. Let's Google you real quick. Let's Google Nate Tithe real quick and see who the hell Nate Tithe is. 
Oh, look here. Nate Tice played for Wisconsin. He used to. He used to play for the Wisconsin Badgers. Okay, Nate. So in 2011, he did not play. 2010, played in two games. Okay, Nate, you score a 17-yard touchdown run against Indiana. Okay, I see you. Wait a minute. In 2009, set out as a freshman. Okay. 2008. Ah, come on, Nate. All right, let's go down here. Let's get a snap shot of his career. Wait a minute. Passing stats, zero yards, zero touchdown, zero interception. Effectiveness, Nate. Just like your fucking article, it has zero effectiveness, you piece of shit. Oh, rushing attempt. Okay, one against that one game that you had. 17 yards, one touch. Okay, okay. Okay, Nate. Okay, now get okay. Let's go to the full stats. Let's check him out. Wait a minute. Wait a goddamn minute, Nate. You only got f the same seventeen yards, Nate. So the only thing you were good at in college was was holding a fucking clipboard. But well, what do I know, Nate? What the hell do I know, right? So Coach Prime went to Colorado, brought his son, right. And all of a sudden, oh, the clicks. Let's get the clicks. So, let me guess right, Nate. I dare you, with your 17 Russian looking ass, to go to Colorado and make some passes behind that offensive line that your door had last year, Date. I dare any quarterback, any quarterback to go to Colorado and pass for 3,000. 230 yards and 27 touchdowns without getting your back broken before the season is over. And then compare yourself to Shadur Sanders and say, hey, man, why didn't you stay in the pocket? Why the hell was I in the pocket? There is no goddamn pocket. The pocket keep breaking down on every goddamn play, so he has to goddamn improvise. But, Nate, what the hell do I know, man? You guys keep putting me out these hit pieces against Colorado and Coach Prime. Why? I have no idea. I had no idea, man. Unless, Nate, unless. Let's go here real quick, Nate. I'm going to let Coach Prime explain to you why. Why you guys keep coming over to Colorado. I'm going to play a clip for you, Nate. Hold your horses here, Nate. I'm going to play a clip for you real quick. This is why, Nate. This is why. It's funny how you say that. This is why, Nate. Clicks, all that shit. Well, it's funny how you say that, but the camera's on when you say it. Right. So who's playing for the click? Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? That's that's a point that I want to talk about, too. Yo, yo. You give that whole speech to say, oh, we don't play for clicks, but you're but getting you're the clicks by for... saying that, so it is ironic. Okay. So tell me this. Yeah. I want you to ask, answer this question honestly. Did you hear any other speech that he made the whole season? Not one. So who was playing for the click? Like, this is what I really do. Like, since high school, you could date it back on YouTube or whatever. This is what I do with my team. Yeah. So this is who we are. The locker yeah. room. Play for clicks. Um, play for clicks. So there it is, Nate. Shit. There it well, is. There it is, Nate. You guys are using Colorado and Coach Prime for clicks. Because you guys are a failed business, Nate. Yahoo Sports is a failed business and nobody goes over there. It's a goddamn ghost town. So the only way to stay relevant is to bait people by making these fucking weird articles and fucked up pictures, Nate, just so people can click on it to bring them to Yahoo Sports. Because once again, I've shown in the beginning, you guys have had a lot of opportunities to do the right thing, but instead... You guys always fumble the goddamn bag. So why would I accept anything from a company that is constantly a fucking failure? At this point, you guys might as well file for bankruptcy and shut it down. Because clearly, nobody over there at Yahoo Sports knows what the fuck they're doing. Including you, Nate, a backup quarterback with 17 rushing yards in your whole fucking career. Your whole career. But you are a quarterback guru and fucking expert. Yes, 
Shador have a lot of work to do. Is he working to improve? You're fucking right. And that's why his dad went out and got him a million fucking offensive dogs. I said it, dogs to protect him. Unlike last year, this year, Nate, if any motherfucker decided to want to cheap shot Sh Shadur Sanders after a sack or whatever it is, oh yeah, we are going to break their foot off in their asses, nigga. That shit is not going to happen ever again. So don't get it twisted, Nate. At this point, you might as well come out and call the Sanders niggers. I'm pretty sure you would get more clicks. I promise you. I know for a fact. I know for a fact, Nate. You guys will get more clicks if you just say we hate niggers. Especially the Colorado Buffalo, Deion Sanders, and fucking Shadur Sanders. Boasting, bragging. All of them people face it all the time. Yes, just say, Nate. Just say it. And I guarantee you have the country. We'll get you back. I'm pretty sure those racist motherfuckers will get you back, Nate. So, before you start... So, Nate, before you start doing your next article, Nate, you might want to do your goddamn job as a damn journalist, which I don't think you are. I don't think you are, Nate. I think it's a guy that goes on fucking Twitter or go to your boss's office and they say, hey, I need something to get clicks. I need something to get clicks. Because it's a goddamn ghost on over here. So I don't care what you got to do, what you got to say. Just get me more clicks over here at Yahoo Sports. Because we got to keep the fucking lights on, Nate. I'm pretty sure that's what's, going, that's what's going on over there, Nate. Just to keep the fucking lights on. You guys just write horseshit after horseshit. We good. We good.